Welcome everybody, my name is Tommy T999 and this is the Battlefield 1 Kills of the Week. We are starting as we normally do with an honourable mention and it comes from Super Lego Man 1234 who is on his motorbike. His squad has spawned into his sidecar and he is struggling to drive up the side of this mountain. So he decides to jump out and let the bike go. And he manages to get a road kill with it. So the enemy that was shooting at him, he managed to take out. And then he picks up one more as well, whilst he's on foot. Last week, your votes gave Alawalid the top spot and a place in the next round. Yes, the kill of the month. Plus, they win themselves a T Triple Nine branded T-shirt. So make sure you get in touch via the comments or my email to get that arranged delivery for you as soon as possible. And if you want to get involved and this could be you next week, all you need to do is leave a link to your clip down below in the comments. But you're about to see more kills for this episode and again it's going to be down for you to vote in the comments below which your favourite is and which should move on to the kill of the month also. First up is kill A and this is JB Streeter. That is an awesome 473 meter on the move snipe in the head. Your next choice, it's kill B and it comes from Brosig 1855. Deep in the trenches, model 10 in hand. And I tell you what, this comes in very handy in this sort of situation, especially when it's all up close and personal. Don't forget, once you've seen all of the clips, it's simple to vote. Just write the letter of your favourite down below in the comments. Your next choice is Kill C, and it comes from Random Jews. What a flanker's cavalry. They just do not see this coming. And when the sword or your horse doesn't work, pull out your gun and continue the domination until finally he does get taken down from afar. Kill D comes from I'm a Scooter LOL. Superb flying here through the canyon. Lovely work indeed. Unfortunately, with only 11 health left, it's definitely time to bail out and watch that plane explode right in front of his eyes, but he is still alive. And that is lucky, because he's then going to do this. Look at your plane! Spotted the plane. Found himself a field gun. We have lost objective. And he's got some flying skills, but I tell you what, he has got some field gun skills as well. Next up, this is Killer E, and it comes from Sir Romney. Positioned here on the mountainside, sniper in hand, and it's all about the accuracy. Do not let any bullet go to waste. No matter the distance, short range, medium range, or even extremely far, far away, always try to make every single bullet count, and that is definitely what Sir Romney is doing right here. Half of our forces remain. 
finally gets taken down, but a lovely streak indeed. We've got some explosives of the week. E5 comes from LP Montage. Spotted the enemy. Throws in the grenade. And one more gets him a huge points tally. Over 1,800 points for disabling and taking down all of those enemy team. Next up is E4, and it comes from LMNTI. All about the trap that was set, hiding behind the door. And as they all stormed in, they didn't think to look to their right, and they ran straight over all of his explosives. Then he picks up two more. And then moves to safety. E3 comes from King DiCarlo94. Going after the train. Explosive set. Grenade goes in. And this is a super side mission to take down the might of the train. But he's only gone and done it. Yes, he has been clubbed to death, but it was worth it to take down that train. Explosive of the week E2 comes from Hell Burn. In goes the grenade. Saw the tank on the hillside. That's a fantastic piece of work. Kill feed with a nice quad there, plus taking down the vehicle with that as well. And then it's time to move on down to continue. Picking off the enemy team one by one. We have lots of both. Now don't forget you can vote for explosives of the week as well if you want one of these progress as your favourite. All you need to do is write the letter E and the number down below in the comments for your vote. So if Hellburn is your best kill of this whole clip series that you've got in this episode, just write E2 down below. And your final explosive of the week is E1 and it comes from Edin Sarkos 5. Found himself a pretty sneaky position here. Plowing them down. And then they come diving in. Flying in from all angles. So the limpet charge is down. And what an explosion. Kill feed goes insane. As does Edin. He did record it. He did send it. And here it is in this week's clips. Kill F. This is Fyodor in a light tank and looking to destroy anything and anyone that is in his way. If you climb on the wall, I'll destroy the wall. If you hide behind the wall, I'll run over you and the wall. It is Roadkill Central with a few picked off with the turret as well. Turn around. Yes, bullets to the face. Lovely bit of work there. Kill G comes from the Freak of VG. Lovely no scope to take down that horse. Dying creeper, one of this. Beautiful headshot there. And another. And he's now face to face with the tank. So switches. And this land ship. Takes a pummeling with the K bullets. Can't quite get that cavalry member. But he does pick off another one of the enemy team with his pistol. Kill H. This is Fluky Jupiter 22. Nice bit of work taking down that plane. One of the enemy that jumped out of it, he's thinking he's got away with this, lies down, and yeah. Unfortunately for him, he laid down at exactly the wrong time. But his teammate is in, trying to use his grenades to take down this tank. To be fair, he's doing a very good job of avoiding getting rogue kill, but what he has done is after that smoke goes out, the one shot later from the tank takes down that truck, and a huge feed and points tally is awarded for those kills. 
Next up is Kill I, and it comes from Lucius G. Spraying hell here in the forest. Stopping their advance as quickly as he possibly can. And then pushes to continue that challenge of taking them all down until finally he is taken out himself. And your final choice this week comes from Kill J, and this is Shushaka Face. Martini yeah, Henry in hand and again all about the accuracy wiping out every single enemy that he sees just look at the feed in the top right hand corner no one else is getting a kill and he'll take the pistol out if need be and then switches it straight back up I'm not sure what anyone else is doing on this team Finally, someone else is on the kill feed in the top corner. But this is unbelievable work. Oh, the tank he spawned. No. I was hiding behind the tank, bro. And the fucking one oh, spawned. I got one. Oh, Shushuka just lighting that kill feed up. Constant pain being given to the enemy team until finally he did get taken out. So there you go, those are your choices. It is now down to you to vote and decide in the comments below which your favourite is and which one should move on to the kill of the month. And if you want to get involved, it is simple. Just leave the link to your clips down below. Plus, that is where you also vote. Just write the letter of your favourite in the comments and the one with the most votes next week will be crowned this week's champion and progress to the next round of the kill of the month. If you want to check out some previous videos, you can. They are linked on screen now. You can follow me on social media. All of those are linked at the bottom. Thanks to everybody for all of your support. We smashed through 400,000 subscribers today. I cannot thank you enough, and I cannot wait to speak to you in the next one.